welcome or welcome back to my book channel. My name is Lauren from Lady Lauren Explore. And today, well, I guess off my new nails. Love them. But um, today I'm talking about a book that I just fell in love with. Something about this plot just like took me in and, and made me like crazy about this, this book. And that is, <laughs> uh, I think it's called Hamaratia. This is by Scarlett Drake. Oh, this book. This is the album cover version of the book and it's beautiful. But then I have the special edition of it, which has Raphael and Jason in it. And it's also beautiful. But I also have another one. And it's literally right there. Another special edition. Let me go get it for you. So I literally have three editions of this book. That's how crazy I am about this book. Crazy. But let me go put this back up. <laughs> okay, so... In this story, we have, actually, let me get this one. In this story, we have Raphael. He is a rock star. He is engaged to a model, an actress. He's in love with her. Then we have Jaehun, Jaehan, I think it's Jaehan. And he is a K-pop idol that has blown up in America with his group. They meet, I think it was like a year or two ago, at an event. And Raphael and his band have, well, first off, they don't know that the K-pop group speak English. So they're talking negatively about them to the point of like calling them, you know, gay slurs and all that kind of stuff. And Raphael, he is not saying anything, but he's not against anything. And he realizes that at one point in time during the night that they actually speak English so they understood what him and his group were saying about them and he feels very shitty about it but it also sparks something in him because he is has like instant attraction to Jay and it's and he just fights it I'm going to say, because it was a once, it was a one thing, time thing. So he's like, okay, whatever. You know, like, I, that's a very shitty of me. Um, I regret not sticking up and not saying anything. And I regret my actions that day. But, you know, on forward. Then, like, he keeps seeing him. And then the attraction keeps going. And he's like, I've never felt attraction to another guy. Like, this is, like, weird, like, what's going on they meet again at the grammys and that sparks a another conversation with them like as in like a real conversation where he decides to tell him like hey i am so sorry for what happened the last time we met i want to um, i mean i'm a fan of yours and that's when the attraction like just becomes even more mind you, he's engaged and so this starts a whole affair of sorts where he is just he doesn't know what he wants he doesn't he knows that like his attraction for jay is becoming stronger and stronger to the point where like he does not want to be married to his fiance but he doesn't under he doesn't know what he wants if he wants to pursue this with jay or not and so he just like has this like very vulnerable conversation with Jay after the Grammy um after parties and it becomes something like I don't know if I'm giving this any justice but let me just tell you that this was very emotional yes this has infidelity in it because he is cheating on his fiance with a k-pop star but the journey that he takes and how he is very persistent once he understands that, like, I, I, I want you. And how Jay is very scared of being wanted is so, so good. The spice is great. And again, this does have infidelity because, like, throughout the whole entire, like, most of the book, I want to say, like, 80% of the book, he is in a relationship. He is fiancés. But he understands at... I think the first instance of them establishing that they want something, he's like, I'm going to break up with her. So, like, and keep in mind, like, he knows he's going to break up with her. 
and things happen. Things happen. It's just, ah. I'm not doing this any justice with how I'm explaining this, but I what I can tell you is I bought this book three times. If that doesn't tell you that like I think this book is amazing, then that like I don't know what to tell you. If you like a soft kind of love, then this is like really for you. I understand like sometimes like when it comes to like the male males, you you want like a switch or something, but this is literally hard and soft. <laughs> and I, I love it. I love it. Yes, what he did was wrong. What he was doing was wrong. But he owns up to that once everything happens. Now, the only thing I did not like was the, I don't want to give it away, but it's, it happens before they're supposed to go to Japan for New Year's. I was just like, like, why was that needed? I don't know why it was needed, but like, why was it needed? But I did love the what happens afterwards because that also shows that like Jay like yeah like Jay is also wanting this as well it's not just all Raphael being the one that's pursuing this we finally get Jay acting on something and it's it shows that he wants this like he's gunning for this like this is this is an action instead of just being there and I loved it I love this so, so much. This is amazing. I cannot wait to read more from Scarlet because, like, this was great. I love both versions of this. I even have some Not Safe for Work and just, like, art prints coming for this. Like, the bathroom scene, um, <laughs> which was <laughs> the Not Safe for Work um print of this which is amazing but yeah I love this this was amazing I I like this is so so good so good it almost reminds me of like pretty obsessed that kind of vibe but yeah this was really great I really want you guys to read this because it's amazing and um yeah that's it. Like, that's all I can tell you. Because I, I don't think I'm giving it any kind of justice. But you have to read this. <laughs> um, my name is Lauren. I post a video Monday, Wednesday, Friday, sometimes Sunday. So please subscribe so you can get on the when I've uploaded. And I hope to see you in my next video. We are almost at 500. And that's under my 500 subscriber giveaway. Where I'll give away a whole bunch of special editions and just like regular editions of books I love um like and some that I know people like want <laughs> and I will sh give you a like a little sneak peek of that when we get closer to 500 so yes yeah, so one of you lucky people will be getting that box but yes I can't wait to I really hope you guys read this book because it's amazing and I will see you later. Bye. <laughs>